We are joining Jill, a corrections officer, who is recently divorced, and she and her two children, are living with her sister. Working in the Department of Corrections during the holiday season, can be more challenging than usual. The separation of families around the holidays is magnified and felt by inmates and staff alike. I'm home, Mom. I miss you. I'm sick of taking care of the kids. You don't think I'm sick of this shit. I wish I was home and not in this shit hole. Mackenzie is having a hard time at school. All her teachers are complaining. I know it's very hard on her for you not to be home for the holidays. Hey sis. You're home later than usual. Are you okay? Today's holiday shift was brutal. There was a waiting room full of sad kids and parents. Just another depressing holiday in the prison. Me and some friends are going out for dinner. It's going to be fun. How about you come with us? Maybe it will help you relax? I'm just missing the kids. I wouldn't be good company right now, I'd just rather be alone. Correction officers face many situations of stress throughout their workday. Working holidays, seeing and hearing children crying, witnessing the sadness in the faces of inmates and their families can be stressful. Lack of interest in social engagements, staying in bed, avoiding leaving the house, missing visits with family, and poor self-care habits, all could be signs of negative reactions to stress. People experience varying losses in their lives. We all have emotions that we struggle to control, and our work environment may remind us of our vulnerabilities. Isolation, irritability, change in sleep and appetite, use of substances, lack of energy, loss of pleasure, no interest in hobbies are symptoms of these challenges. Positive coping includes engagement in, spending time with family and friends. Social and community groups. Hobbies. Spirituality, religious activities. Exercise. Meditation. Mindfulness. Predictable sleep pattern. Some limited time alone to process and think through experiences. Accept and seek out therapy.